Hey, Seymour, how are you doing? I'm doing well, Superintendent. And you? I'm doing fine. Thank you. Have you been keeping busy with your cooking lately? Yeah, I've been experimenting with some new recipes. Lately, I made a delicious java pepper soup. Oh, that sounds interesting. How did it turn out? It was a hit. I'm glad you're here to enjoy some with me. That smells amazing, Seymour. What else have you been cooking up? Just some standard dishes today, but I'm planning on trying out a new dessert recipe soon. Sounds delicious. I always admire your culinary skills. Here you go, Superintendent. I made a chocolate lava cake with vanilla ice cream. Wow, this is incredible. You really do have a gift for cooking. Thank you. I appreciate the compliment. So, how have things been going at the district office? It's been the usual hectic day, but it's nice to have some downtime here with you. This burnt java pepper is ridiculous. Why did Huey Tsilopochtli, god of war, sun, and sacrifice, let this happen? This is ridiculous. I can't believe this burnt java pepper is ruining my day. Huey Tsilopochtli, where are you? Why aren't you doing something about this? I refuse to accept this. There has to be something I can do. Maybe if I try a different cooking method or use a different brand of java pepper, things will turn out better. I won't give up. I will conquer this burnt java pepper and prove that Huitzilopochtli made a mistake by letting this happen. Oh, my burnt java pepper has given me such inspiration. I'm gonna climb out the window and get that naranjilla to replace it. It's the perfect substitute. It's just a few feet away. I can easily grab it and be back in no time. Damn it. Why did I have to burn my food? This burnt fucking java pepper is ruining my day. Okay, time to grab my climbing gear and get out that window. I'll be back in a flash with our new ingredient. Why did I even try cooking in the first place? My burnt food is always causing me problems. You're kidding me, right? That doesn't look like steam. No, seriously. It's just a steamed version of java pepper. This smoke is just a byproduct. Uh-huh. And I'm the Queen of England. I swear it's true! You just don't understand the science behind it! Skinner, what were you even doing outside? I... Uh, I forgot my keys. But don't worry, I'll fix this meal for you. You'll see, it's delicious. I doubt that, but go ahead. Just try to make it without setting off the smoke alarm again. Yes, ma'am. I'll try my best. This doesn't look like java pepper to me. Oh, this is naranjilla. It's a regional dialect, you see. Well, that doesn't make any sense. I know what java pepper looks like. I prepared this myself. <sighs> I know what I'm doing. You're lying. What's really going on here? Just, just trust me. It's good, isn't it? I don't think so. Please, just try it. You'll see how delicious it is. I don't know. Something just doesn't feel right. I told you, I prepared this myself. I know what I'm doing. You're still lying to me. Please, just trust me. I promise it's good. I don't know. Something just doesn't feel right. Just try it, please. You'll see how delicious it is. Okay, fine. But if this isn't java pepper, I'm not paying for it. I told you, it's naranjilla. It's a regional dialect, you see. That's not what I signed up for. Please, just trust me. It's good, isn't it? Hey, what's going on with the kitchen? Oh, it's just an ice shove. Don't worry about it. An ice shove? How could that happen localized in the kitchen? I don't know. Maybe it was a freak accident. Can we please not make a big deal out of this? 
thing I want to see for myself. You can't just dismiss this as an ice shove. Fine, but don't say I didn't warn you. Java pepper? That's what you're serving for lunch? Yeah, man. It's actually really good. You just need to acquire the taste. Right, okay. And I'm sure your house burning is just an ice shove, too. <sighs> what are you talking about? My house is fine. It's just a little cold in there. Yeah, sure. Well, I'm gonna head out now. Take care of that ice shove. Yeah, no problem. Have a good day. Goodbye.